Let's take a look at how we can label polygons showing their area when we don't have that as a column in our data set. So I've got some building polygons on screen. I'll open the table and we can see there's a number of columns, but none of them have the area in it. That's not a problem in QGIS. So let me show you how. I'll close the table and then I'll double click on the layer name. This is going to open up layer properties. And first of all, I'll just check the information tab. The reason I want to do that is because in the coordinate reference system section, I just want to check what the, what the units are. And here it's meters. So when I'm labeling area, it's using meters. So let's go to labels and change it from no labels to single labels. And the value I've entered here is just dollar sign then area. But I'll click the little expression button because I'm going to format it. So I type in format underscore number, open bracket. I'm using area to label it. I'll put in a comma and then I'll put in one. That's how many decimal places. So that's going to be square meters. So now I will click on OK and then apply. And in the background, if I increase the size of these labels, we can see that they have one decimal place. And I could change this to zero. So they've got no decimal places. And let me do one more thing via the expression. If I want to add an SQM for square meters, I can just hit the string concatenation, put in a single quote, a space, an SQM, and a single quote, and click OK and apply. So now I've labeled all these polygons with their area in square meters to zero decimal places, and I've added SQM after it.